There are six domains in the ID Competency Library. This one is experimenting. Experimenting only has two focal points, so let's look at those. The first focal point, experimenting one, is intellectual exploration. I feel like this one's pretty straightforward, but let's go over it real quick. So the first one is students can go beyond assumptions and beliefs when exploring ideas and solutions. So this is about getting outside their comfort zone. Um, brief students especially often think they know um, about a demographic. I remember we were doing the antiques um, booth and a couple of my students said, well, people our age or people in their 20s, young people don't like these things. And then uh, the group that was actually working on the brief said, no, actually, our data we found is exactly the opposite. So you could use this one with a, I used to think, now I think, um, those kind of uh, tools. So let's look at the next one. We have experimenting, um, focal point one still, but this is competency two. Students can offer a broad range of clear and relevant ideas to the design challenge. So this is a good place to get your students that make the less obvious contributions to the work. Um, you can use it with tasks that go for volume. Um, there's another one later that also goes for volume, but this is one of those where you can kind of catch a student that is contributing to the work, but in a less obvious way. Competency three is about students can break down complex ideas, products, or processes into their parts to understand how and why they work. So this is just component parts. It's not only physical. It could also be breaking down ideas and research. So those are the only three in intellectual exploration. Let's go over to focal point two, which is experimental prototyping. And under experimental prototyping, we have students can generate volume of new ideas. So like the one on the intellectual exploration side, this is for the student that can come up with a, a great deal of new ideas. They're casting a wide net at this point. This is usually early in the work. Um, when they're going for a hundred ideas in three minutes or tools like that can apply to this one. Um, there's only two um, focal point, I mean, sorry, there's only two competencies in this focal point. And so under experimental prototyping, the second competency says students can retest and prototype ideas to design a solution that meets the needs of a specific user. So this is keeping everything focused on the user. Um, resisting the urge to um, discontinue iteration when they think they've got it. There's always that time when uh, students fall in love with their first or second idea. And this is that competency that says, keep going, keep pinpointing, keep asking questions and keep iterating. All right, so that's the um, focal points for the domain, the competencies for the domain on experimenting. Let's go.